Okay, this is me again. I'm driving over to Pinellas County, all the way over to Clearwater, because people refuse to do their jobs. Because the county commissions uh, refuse to get in the faces of these supervisors of elections that continue to screw up elections. Here's Tampa Bay. I live on the other side of the state. And I used to just be going over to, to Hillsboro, which is behind me, but I've just entered into Pinellas County en route to Clearwater, okay? I'm so disgusted I can't see straight. The media has stopped covering the issue. And it, people are just going to let it die. 36,000 votes, again, were driven around in the middle of the night, you know, after close of polling during the primary, put into, this time put into bags. USB chips were placed into bags. And then the bags were driven around and then handed over to the Supervisor of Elections Office, who then voted the ballots from the USB chips. And I was told yesterday by a lady named Whitlock that essentially it wasn't ballots that, that were being voted again. The whole, no, they weren't ballots. See, they were USB chips. And I actually had to argue with her for five minutes. Just I, I had to cross-examine this woman. When I didn't really argue, I just very calmly cross-examined her and got her to admit that each USB chip a whole had accepted ballots. And because of that, we're talking about ballots. And then, and only then, could I get her to admit how many ballots we were talking about. And it turns out the number was 36,000. 36,000. Essentially, the entirety of the vote on primary election day. All right, so I'll check back with you.